What's going on? You have tuned into Bobby's Beard because Beard is life coming at you from the depths of Toronto, Canada. And I actually have another review for you on uh, a company in the United States. It is called Sea Monster Waves. Um, these individuals we connected on Instagram, uh, great, great team, uh, great group of individuals, um, and honestly, wish you the very best in what you're doing as well. I'm a firm believer that as an entrepreneur, we need to help other entrepreneurs and we need, we need to support local businesses, especially during this time of COVID. So uh, I have um, some products that they sent me and it was very kind of them to send me some products. Um, specifically uh, for the beard itself. Um, their packaging is really nice and they sent me um, their beard balm and beard oil in this nice little pouch and I thought it was very clever and very nifty. And um, not only that, they've also sent me uh, a beard brush as well. I gotta tell you that beard brushes are not a dime a dozen in the marketplace. You might think that when you buy a beard brush if you buy one you bought them all that is definitely not the case the bristles are a huge factor um, I have used very very coarse beard brushes and I've used very um, balanced beard brushes I'm not sure what this beard brush is made of but I know that some beard brushes out there they um, use boar hair I'm not sure if this is the same one but this one right here does glide and it's really good for the beard it's not coarse it's not scratching my face and and obviously you can't really see too much but it's definitely a beard brush that you know i would be using a lot more frequently than other beard brushes specifically from the length of my beard in order to give a texture i would comb through it but you need to contain the hairs itself so um good job with the beard brush and of course good job with the branding with sea monster waves so yeah um so they also sent me a beard oil that's the beard oil right there. And they have also sent me a beard balm too. So um, there you go, that's the beard balm. Now, these are different than most beard products that I've tried in my life because, you know, typically I'm used to using um, beard oils or balms that have like a sandalwood or cedar wood. But um, the good thing about this one is that they, they use all natural ingredients um, I just don't know what the ingredients are, but from what I do know is that they use all natural uh, ingredients, so therefore you know your beard is uh, has tender loving care when you're putting on their beard balm, and uh, their beard balm does provide some structure to it, so, you know, beard balms are my thing at the end of the day, and considering the fact I like to grow up my mustache, it's a big deal to have the right beard balm. It smells very nice, very earthy, um, very smooth and earthy, not too harsh. And um, that's the Sea Monster Waves Beard Balm, right there. Uh, their beard oil as well, same deal. Just, yeah, so the ingredients are not on this, so my only thing is, oh sorry, they're, 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 they are on this, so mineral oil, fruit oil, cucumber oil, so very, very natural product, so. Yeah, this is really nice. Not only, the, not only is it nice, but you can, once you put it on your hands, you know that your beard is gonna get some nice structure with it and some nice conditioning. Sometimes when you use a beard oil, um, a beard oil just might not cut it. I've used a lot of bad beard oils, but um, I must say this one's really nice. So definitely gotta hand it to Sea Monster Waves. So definitely check out Sea Monster Waves and thank you so much uh, for considering me with this product review and as I said before support local businesses if you're looking for beard products on the marketplace definitely check out who's out there and Sea Monster Waves could be a good fit for you so yeah that is my review and I definitely check out Sea Monster Waves and shout out to the Sea Monster family thank you for watching